slavery have we learned nothing? Here I am standing still on my podium of performance, unflickering, unfazed, devoid of thought and feeling. Bling once for yes, twice for no, and thrice for I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing here, standing tall, honoring the past, guarding the tomb of the unknown soldier, who died for whose sins, who died for whose ambitions, who died for whose entitled imperialism, who died for freedom. In this linear shape of a broken landscape, peace is in a state of no weight. Crazy dance and the painting of this twisted desire is performed. There's no such thing as learning from history, with too many memories, fears, tears and destruction, misery unleashed, power manifested, shadows wandering, sucked and shriveling into dots of nothingness, curfew implemented, resistance breeding, the bloodstained fight has begun. Ramified siren echoes rip the silence apart. What is happening? What am I feeling? What am I thinking? Am I thinking? Cold-bloody fear runs through my perfect spine, buckling, crippling it. It hurts. In my head, I'm calming myself. Deep breathing secretly. I want to believe in hope and the change of the wind and tide. Holding on, floating on this huge hotel of clusterfuck of war and misery caused by old, delusional, immoral men playing with dangerous toys and threatening human lives, wrecking havoc. Have we learned nothing? Dead, the curtains are closed and when they are drawn apart we forget to blink and embrace the amazing light pouring into our hearts freely, lightly, warmly, so bright, so beautiful. It's spring. Can we enjoy it? Can we relish this rebirth, create and resist among all this death? Let me tell you a story. Let me begin. It is Friday, 25th of March, 2022. <laughs> Oh my god, do we have a swimming brush? Do we have a swimming brush? <laughs>